be safe. What a really lovely man. It was good to chat to him. Now we're going to move on to the weather. It's been a really dull old day. Another one. But Nina has a bit of news about some sunshine tomorrow. We have seen some rain during the last couple of hours, but at least for much of the day it was dry with some bright spells. So for our weather watchers, a fine day to be heading out, although along the south coast we did have some fairly big waves. Things were a little stormy and that's because the air of low pressure to the west of the UK is fairly deep. It's cleared by tomorrow, so we're back to some dry weather with some bright or sunny spells. Most places will miss the showers. There could just be one or two along the south coast. So this evening, the last of that rain will clear away from East Kent. You can still see the showers here and there, but temperatures will start the day at around 8 or 9 degrees. So we're looking at a generally dry day, well broken clouds giving some further spells of sunshine. Any showers really limited along the south coast, although there could be one or two heavier downpours. And temperatures with that southwesterly breeze lifted to around about 10 to 12 degrees. So we are still a little above average. Then as we go through the evening, it is going to be dry, but into the early hours of Friday morning, the clouds start to increase and we're set to see some patchy and some light rain. Temperatures first thing at around 9 degrees and through the morning it does stay fairly overcast, still a little damp and drizzly. But we're expecting the rain to clear away, although lots of cloud will last through the afternoon. Just some limited brightness later on in the day with highs again of 12 degrees. For the weekend forecast, whilst low pressure is still sitting out to the west of the UK, for us not too many showers. We're expecting some sunny spells and with those winds still coming in from the southwest, it will stay relatively mild with afternoon temperatures of around about 12 degrees. Nina, thank you. Well, that is it from us. We'll be back at 6.30 tomorrow and Marcella Whittingdale will be here after the late news at 10 o'clock. Hope you can join her then. In the meantime, bye-bye. It's been a